Hello everybody, Eastwood here, and welcome back to some more Project Zomboid on the Grape Seed map. <laughs> and uh you guys you guys didn't miss much. I uh I tried to grab as much stuff as I could from the old place and bring it back here, so I kinda have a pile of crap in my bedroom. I did some organization. I know you probably don't believe me, uh, but I, I honestly did. I tried to organize a little bit. Um, we'll probably go back to the burn down base tomorrow just to make sure I didn't miss anything. Plus, I want to go to the roof and check out the crops because I noticed I don't think they burned. I, I really don't think they burned. Uh, so, yeah, I think maybe this episode we'll, we'll, we'll just take it a little easy, so to speak. Uh, I think, I, I think I'm going to do some farming here, get some crops back into the ground, since as of this moment, this is, this is where we're living, right? Until I find some other place to try to take over in grapeseed. Uh, I want to build a water collector today, barrel. Can we do that? Ah, shit. We can't do that yet, can we? I don't think we can. Ah, hell no. We still need one more level of carpentry. But we do have the carpentry multiplier, so I guess we could go try to take apart some stuff. Damn it. Well, I can still build a composter and a few other things, I think. So it's 210, and I think we're going to get rain tonight, according to the radio. I think that's what it said. Uh, so let's, let's see if we can't get some stuff planted. How's that sound? I've got a trowel on me, tomatoes, strawberries, potatoes, radishes. Uh, where did I stick those cabbage seeds? I just had them. Where'd they go? Oh my god. I was like, yeah, I'll put them here. I'll remember where they're at. No. There they are. They're in my backpack. Okay, cool. So, yeah. Let's just, uh, let's go do some gardening. That sounds nice and relaxing, right? And for once, it seems quiet. I should probably keep my mouth shut, though, to be honest. Uh, yeah. So let's, let's do... Let's do some gardening. And as always, I'm gonna space them out. I wonder how crazy I should go with it. I guess we'll try to do... Oh, I don't know. Maybe a single row for every type of plant we have at the moment, maybe? I don't know. Look at all these moodles up here. <laughs> Unpleasantly hot. Well, I guess we can fix a little bit of that. Let's, uh, let's take off your jacket. That should... Yeah, there we go. Now we're dropping on the temperature. You see, I dropped all my paint. My paint out. Does that say paint for you? That's funny. So all these paint buckets will collect water as well. This is going to be a giant garden. Holy shit. This might be the last plot that I that I dig out. <laughs> I mean, especially considering the fact that we have no electricity at the moment because somebody burned the generator. So we're not really going to have any way to store any of these damn vegetables. All right, that's enough digging, Vic. Think you earned yourself a cigarette? Yeah. It's 
smoke through that mask. At the very minimum, I need to build a composter today so that we can uh, put all my rotten food in it. Cabbages. Cabbages. Guess it won't pull them out of my backpack for me. I think I'm going to leave the cabbages just one row. One row for each type of plant. Wait, what? Open. Potatoes. Boil them, mash them, stick them in a stew. Alright, we got cabbages. We got potatoes. We got... Yeah, sure, why not? Grow some damn tomatoes. Who cares? Let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, we have a lot of tomato packets. Strawberries, radishes, got all sorts of shit. Carrots. All right. This is already looking really nice. I can't wait for the undead to show up and trample my crops. All that fuss for the rooftop garden. And I had this beautiful plot of land behind me the whole time. I don't know. I just think the idea of having a rooftop garden is kind of cool. Uh, so we don't have any broccoli. Can't plant broccoli. Plant some radishes. And what else we got left? Strawberries. I'm not a huge fan of strawberries uh, in Zomboid, but I don't know. I'll give them another try. I think they, they keep giving strawberries. Like, even after you harvest, they just keep growing. So that's kind of cool. You know, most of the other plants, once you harvest them, they're done. Hell, I think even tomato plants disappear. I don't think they keep giving. Could be wrong, though. One, two, three, four, five, six... Uh, so we planted cabbages, carrots, potatoes, radishes, strawberries, tomatoes. Yeah, we're just missing broccoli. We got six worms. Oh my goodness, look. I forgot I was actually using my seed bag at one point in my life. Yeah, I need to definitely need to build some crates out here for storage. I was just hesitant to do a lot of that because I thought we were going to be moving into a different base. Oh yeah, uh, earlier when I wasn't recording, I, I realized that these flyers out here on the ground, you can pick them up. Evacuation flyer. It's kind of cool, so I guess I'll show you. If you read it, just gives you a warning from the army. Military operations will be conducted to call the infected in the area. I don't know. I thought this was kind of cool. You know, it's like a little bit more lore sprinkled in. Kind of neat. Uh, I completely cleaned out the back of the vehicle too. Just FYI, it's... Well, it's pretty much empty. There's just some, you know, uh, tools back here for the car. Some gas cans, wood axe. Otherwise, pretty empty. I even took a few gas can, a couple gas cans out of the front seat. Uh, we're very tired. Go figure. Put the rest of our seeds away. Yep, definitely need to make a crate outside to store our farming stuff in. Uh, I'm actually going to be a bum. And we're just going to drop it on the floor right now. Uh, but I swear, I will I will get, get to building that crate. Hello, refrigerator, of which... Does not refrigerate. <laughs> it's 
throw this flyer in the trash. We don't need it. Remind me to get these rotten things out. I need to build that composter. Uh, composter. We need four nails and five planks. Well, I can certainly get the nails. I've got more packets on me. I'm so disorganized. Like, look at all this garbage. Oh, crap. I forgot about these 31 potatoes. Oh, my God. And four boxes of nails. I only need one. Thank you. We've got plenty of books to keep us busy, though. That's good. Yeah, I still have quite a bit of crap. I really do. I need to sit down and do some reading and start taking apart some of this stuff. Lord knows we'll level electricity pretty damn quick. I guess go ahead and throw the potatoes in here. I may. In fact, I think I will. I think I'll make a salad before we get to bed. Just because the potatoes are fresh right now. Uh, so we should probably take advantage of it while we can. Give me that bowl. And give me that fork. If I stand right here, close enough to the refrigerator, and this cupboard, I should be able to make a pretty good salad. I should be able to reach all my ingredients, which is pretty much nothing. Excellent. Yep, this is just going to be potatoes and cabbage with uh, some salt and pepper. Nothing too crazy about that. But like I said, I'd rather use these cabbages and potatoes while they're relatively fresh-ish. We're going to make it a beastly salad. Fifty-nine. Yeah, that's a good one. And we're going to use our fork. Look at us go. Eat, Vic, eat. Full to bursting. That's what we like to see. Hell yeah. Okay, so I guess I could sit down and read for a little while, because if I go to bed right now, we're going to wake up pretty, uh, pretty early in the AM would be my guess. So let's finish reading my Electricity for Beginners book would be a good idea. So I'm going to sit here in the middle of my garbage in my room. And let's just grind this out real quick. We'll go to bed at, uh, I don't know, midnight maybe. That should be okay. Read, Vic, read. Knowledge is power. Oh, shit. Why is it all weird and red outside? What the hell does that mean? That, look, that looks very weird. You're ridiculously tired. Well, you're going to read till midnight, Vic. I don't care. Okay, that's good. I know we're almost finished with the book, but my boy my boy Vic needs some sleep here. And smoke a ciggy before we go to bed so we don't wake up with night terrors or wake up anxious or whatever. Turn on my alarm for It's usually set for 9, but we are a tired boy today, so we'll go to 10 and hopefully everything's good. Ah, what the hell? Strong panic and anxious. I, I smoked a cigarette so this wouldn't happen, Vic. Why? Why did you do this? I don't even have any sleeping pills. No. In fact, our medical supplies are pretty non-existent. <laughs> I don't need all this thread. 
Oh, I need to drop that crowbar too. I took it out of the back of the vehicle. If you're wondering why I'm not storing anything uh, in these this cupboard here, it's because it's full. We're full of crap. Like I said, I seriously need to do some organization. Uh, you're still not sleepy, Vic, so... I'll tell you what, let's... Instead of sitting here and doing nothing, let's read some more. You may as well if you're not gonna go to bed. Okay, maybe six? Will you go to bed now? No, nope, still can't go to sleep. You bastard. Still can't go to sleep. Whatever. Just finish your book then. I'm glad it rained though. We got our crop in. Crop's in the ground. That's what we wanted. Still can't sleep. Well, we're boned then. I think. Uh, there's another book. Finished. Electricity. Where am I clicking? What am I doing? Uh, what's the next book we should do? Remove this bandage. I completely forgot about this. Okay, let's let's take the stitch out. You think we're good? I bet we're good. Maybe. Eh. Oh, we're just scratched now. Put, put a band-aid on it. Cool. Very cool. Still can't go to sleep. Uh skills. We have a multiplier of five. Our electrical boost is full now. Mechanics is full. Oh wait, electrical's full. Yeah, let's let's go ahead and just do that right now. Let's let's gather all these watches and headphones and random crap that I've been collecting. Actually, do I want to keep the headphones? I know I have earbuds and a radio somewhere around here. We'll keep the headphones for now. Here's seven watches. The flashlight we don't need, I can take that apart. Some more earbuds, we can take those apart. Hand torch, take that apart. Ah, here we go. There's some radios. Which we don't need, because we have a ham radio in there. Okay, next side. More watches. More earbuds. Curious to see how many um, electronics we've got at the end of this. There's my walkie-talkie. I, I guess I'll keep it. Because it weighs the least. I think it's the one I have the earbuds on too. Yeah, okay. Is there anything over here? Yeah, I don't store anything in here. It only holds 10 though. And I want to say I've got more electronics somewhere over here. I kind of had them spread out everywhere. I forgot about that axe. Okay, maybe that is all our electronics. 21 watches. Okay, so let's see here. We have 1.75 electrical. Let's start dismantling watches. If I dismantle all, will it dismantle the one I'm wearing? I, I wonder. So let's let's take this watch. Let's drop this watch just to be careful. And now if I go up here and I click dismantle watch 51. Oh, okay. So okay, it, it wasn't gonna dismantle the one I was wearing. I could wear two watches, but eh, I don't care. So here we go. Let's dismantle 50 watches. <laughs> Let's zoom through it. Woo! Go, Vic, go! Hey, we leveled. You noticed it didn't pop up above my damn head. But we did. We got level one electricity already, just from our stack of watches. Very nice. Very, very nice. Uh, what else? What else? Is that? That's in my backpack. So I see, yeah, that's my good flashlight. We don't want to take that one apart. Let's take this one apart. 
Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye, radios. What else I got? Two earbuds, dismantle those. Is that it? That might be it. Yep. Where are we at? All right. Not not very far into level two, but you can see all that hoarding of watches paid off. At least we got through level one. Uh, I think the next book I'm probably gonna read. Probably farming or cooking would probably be smart. Not that I know anything about being smart. Uh, this is going to drive people crazy, but I'm going to drop all these electronics and stuff right here. I, I really do need to... Build some crates and do some organization. I need an electrical crate and a weapons crate and farming crate and all that good stuff. Like I said, chill episode. Pretty chill episode. I guess I'll throw the books in the trash. I know we can burn them though. Okay. Uh, we've still got some time in the episode, so let's see if I can't find something else for us to do. I guess I'll throw these packets in here. At least all our seeds are in one spot. Nine thirty in the morning. We're hungry. I know. Whatever. We'll make another damn salad. I just I need to use them. I should. While well, we've got them, I'll just use them. Oh, that cabbage is rotten. Did it just rot when I took it out? Oh no! Are all my cabbages rotten? Ah, the rest of them went rotten. Oh, I got some eggs, but I need to cook them. I'd have to make a fire. So our, our salad here is just going to be potatoes, I guess. Are we already out of cab? All my cabbages went bad, I guess. Overnight, the rest of them did. Sad days. Bad sad days. Unhappiness plus six. Did I put something nasty in there? Oh, I guess it's because it's just all potatoes. Well, I'm sorry, Vic. You're just going to have to deal with it, buddy. It's a rough world out there, okay? Okay, can we scrounge some... some planks from somewhere? I could take that apart, I guess. Uh, or better yet, we could just go to the burned down base. Let's, uh, let's, whatever, let's go. Actually, what am I talking about? There's a metric shit ton of planks over there in the warehouse. Let's go check that out. I'm gonna bring a bunch of planks back over here so we can build a bunch of crates and whatnot. Oh, hey, buddy. I, I, I didn't even see him there until, like, the last second. Uh, I'll pull up a little bit further. There we go. Hello, friend. Hey, you're the only zombie we've seen all episode. Bonk. Bonk. Oh. Oh, he, I, I was going to say it was a two hit, but no, it wasn't. Oh, that's right. You can't disassemble those, the classic ones. 
Okay, how many of you are in here, scum? None. That's what I like to see. Uh, I'm a dummy and left all my duffel bags behind, didn't I? I sure did. Ah, whatever. Throw the planks on you, buddy. As many as you can carry, Vic. No more. Okay. Go throw them in the back. Oh, so heavy. Rainy, rainy, rainy. Sixty one Fahrenheit. Not insanely cold, but a little bit. Yeah, I know. I see the nails on the ground. I'm just not, I just really don't care. <laughs> really don't care about these nails. I have so many boxes of nails. Who gives a shit? Oh, there's another paint can. Pour that paint out. Just one more bucket we can throw in the uh, backyard. Oh, I closed it. I am not going to be able to fit all these planks back here. Nope. That's all she wrote. But I can fit a few. And by a few, I mean like what? Two? Oh, three. Come on, lose the weight. There were two zombie friends. Look at them. Look at them. Four. Four zombies already back over here. This place really is just an absolute shit show. I know I said we were going to go check the crops out on top of the base, but we'll do it. We'll probably do it next episode. I'll do one last check to make sure I didn't miss anything. But I'm feeling pretty good about it. Guess I could hold a little bit more. Come here, stupid planks. Box and L's open. Where are my ciggy? Smoke your ciggy. Uh, let's drop some of these planks right now before we break our poor back. Oh, oh my god, he dropped those fast. I needed at least two of those, buddy. One or two of them, I forget. Hello, buckets. There's another bucket friend for you. Now, what was I doing? I wanted to make a composter before the end of the episode. Uh, we'll just... Where should I put it? Ah, that looks good. I'm not going to be too picky about it. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Okay. 
grab all the rotten stuff. Except the milk. We can still make spray out of that later. Down the line. Rotten bread, rotten cabbages, rotten peas. Yeah, our food situation's not that great at the moment. To be quite frank with you. But we could always go to Rosewood and loot the uh the grocery store there, so I'm really not too worried. In fact, we might uh, we could do that next episode, I guess. There's a lot of things we could do. Rotten bread, all these rotten cabbages, cherry, mutton chop, blah blah blah. There we go. Now at least we have a compost bin. It's something. It is something. Woo! I'm gonna go ahead and end it right there. Uh, you know, I, I said at the beginning it was gonna be a more chill episode. I I'm just tired of running around and burning zombies and purging the undead. I just wanted to kind of relax a little bit tonight, and I feel like farming is a pretty chill thing to do in Zomboid. One of the few things that's pretty relaxing. That and fishing. Uh, but yeah, I, I feel pretty good about what we got done today. Uh, next episode, we'll go back to the old base. Like I said, just to make sure I'm not missing anything. We'll check on the crops on the top of the roof just to see what happened to them. I think they're still alive, though. And um, we'll start uh, scoping out grape seed. See if we can't find a, a new base, maybe, or at least a new generator to bring back here. Um, if you guys have any suggestions or anything you want to see me do, feel free to comment. And I'll take it into consideration. Uh, if you guys enjoyed what you saw, give me a like. If you didn't, give me a dislike. And if you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time.